Yo, what's good everybody? Hector here, back again with another video for you guys. I would like to welcome all you guys back to the channel, but if you are new to the channel, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button real quick and that bell icon so you're notified whenever I drop new content to the channel. Also, be sure to leave a like on this video because a like goes a long way and it helps the channel out. So now that that's out the way, it happened again. Yeah, I think you guys know what I'm talking about. Yo, boy, hit up the sneakers up again. That's right, yo, another W chalked up for me on the sneakers app. Now y'all wouldn't even imagine how surprised I was. Literally, these sneakers, I wasn't even gonna go for them. But I was like, you know what? Let me give it a try and see what happens. You know, I put in my size, boom, boom, boom. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. And then purchased, got them. What? Nah, but I am a little bit too hyped. Let me take a chill. But yeah, I did end up hitting on this sneaker. I really didn't want it, but like having it in hand now, Definitely changed my mind because these sneakers look way better in person than they do in the pictures. So I'm actually glad I did get them. Now the thing that did throw me off about this sneaker is um this is how they came. They weren't double box. This is the actual shoe box. Nike sent it out in the shoe box. They wrapped tape all the way around it. They screwed up the size tag and it just you know it, it kills the box. Like if you plan on reselling this sneaker, it's just kind of just like you're gonna have to get a crappy box that's taped up and wasn't double box. So I feel like that definitely kills the value, you know, unless you're gonna actually, you know, keep the sneaker and wear or whatever. So, you know, it, it's just a box, it doesn't really matter if you're not gonna resell it. But enough about that, let's actually just get right into the sneaker because I'm excited to see these sneakers. I'm excited to review these sneakers. So as usual, you guys already know, I like unboxing my sneakers with you guys. So uh, let's get it right off the bat that looks awesome that looks pretty dope you got the nike logo right there you got the space hippie and this like futuristic space looking text you got some random barcode thing there but nike trash transformed it kind of, kind of says it twice um okay but uh you got the space hippie logo right there and you got some globe or whatever i don't know what that means what does that mean eco-friendly or something like that I, I don't know but it comes with a bag right here i guess this is to carry your sneakers it's uh i guess it's made out of recycled materials also it feels like those shopping bags that you take you know like the reusable ones but yeah this is the bag i guess you use it to carry your sneakers you got the swoosh circle as i like to call it you got the nike space hippie one two and three uh pretty cool pretty cool but now let's just get right to these sneakers there you have it ladies and gentlemen nike space hippie one space hippie one in the black week colorway right off the bat you can tell this sneaker is like nothing you've ever seen before look at just just look at the freaking midsole and outsole it literally has tiny pieces of other sneakers that were about to be thrown out like, like recycled sneakers that is pretty dope there's so many colors there's oranges and greens blacks blues like it's crazy check out the bottom there's so many colors i already know this is my favorite part of the sneaker got a little nike swoosh right there got the swoosh circle right there as i like to call it and then right there you got some random logos that that earth logo and it looks like wi-fi Wi wi-fi these shoes come with Wi-Fi? So yeah, I don't know, I don't know if y'all can see that, but it looks like Wi-Fi bars. Like, you know, all right, space hippies with Wi-Fi included, that would be pretty dope. They don't come with Wi-Fi, but you know, just me out here trying to be some kind of comedian. So let's go ahead and check out the upper. You got a prime knit upper. You got the giant swoosh right there in golden, like a golden brown color. It looks really nice. I don't know if y'all can see it on the camera, but it does have some shine to it it's it's really nice and then on the front you have the zero one and then just running up the tongue it's like a like a pull tab and it says nike on it now the lacing system is super 
cool i love it so much it's like another one of my favorite things about the sneaker it's just pretty much like a a, a, a shoelace it looks like a, a shoelace too like a recycled shoelace that they kind of just ran around through here and then you just lace it through like I love it. I, I, I think it's pretty cool. And it definitely gives the sneaker a pretty cool look. Now here on the inside of the sneaker, you got another Nike swoosh. But yo, those colors, jeez, look. So fire. So taking a look at the inside, there's like no insole, like no traditional insole. It's like made of this foamy material. It's actually pretty comfortable. It's soft. I think it's like stitched in there so I can't take it out and I don't want to destroy my sneaker so uh, we'll just leave it in there and appreciate it from afar. So here on the back pull tabs you have the swoosh circle. I know this is probably not what it's called but like I said I call it the swoosh circle because there's a bunch of swooshes in the circle. Now these do also come with a set of white laces and honestly I think the black laces look so much better. I haven't tried the white laces, so I'll, I'll probably throw those on and see how those look. Matter of fact, I'll just throw them on now, see how they look. All right, so here's what I did. I left one with the black laces, and then I swapped out the white laces for this one. So uh, which one do you guys like better? Looking at the white laces now, it, it actually doesn't look too bad. You know, the white goes with the white from the midsole, and it's pretty cool. But I feel like I, I feel like I still like the black ones way better. Like they just accent the sneaker way more. So yeah, let me know in the comments below which side do you like better? You like the black side or the white side? So real quick, I want to talk about comfort with these. Um, they're actually pretty comfortable, being that they're made of like the prime knit upper. You know, they 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 stretch. So like if you have like a wide foot or whatever, you put your foot in there, it'll stretch out no problem and it's super lightweight this thing doesn't weigh a thing this is like so light this would make a perfect running sneaker or like if you go to the gym you want to hit the gym rock with these and like you'll feel like you have nothing on your feet these don't weigh anything like at all another thing about these is like they look a lot like yeezys they literally have the exact same shape which i feel like that's why another reason that i like this sneaker so much is because like i love yeezys i love yeezys i have a crap ton of yeezys i love yeezys so this one this one looking like a yeezy is like a win because like the shape is there the shape is definitely there you got one shoe you got the yeezy and then you got the space hippie well give you a little side by side comparison Check the front out. The laces are obviously different styles. This one has the infinity laces, which you can switch out. This one has the regular string laces, but the shape is literally there. So before we move on, I want to also touch up on the box. Like this box, hold on. This box is pretty dope on the inside. It looks amazing and I'm glad that they did this inside rather than outside because if they would have done this on the outside guess what the tape would have covered all of that but yeah check the box out the box is amazing got Nike written right there space hippie with a QR code I don't know what that's for maybe I'll scan it later Nike space hippie again this thing just has space hippie written all over it you got this digital swoosh. Overall, this is probably one of the coolest shoe box I've ever like seen. Like literally, this is a pretty cool shoe box, but enough about that. Oh wait. But anyway, I think I finally reached the part of the video where I have nothing more to say about this sneaker. If you guys can think of anything else, please drop it in the comments. But now I think it's about that time, so let's hit it with some B-roll.
you guys have it. There was my quick review on the Nike Space Hippie 1 black wheat colorway if you guys did make it this far and enjoyed this video please go ahead and drop a like on this video because a like goes a long way and it helps the channel out and if you're not already subscribed to the channel please go ahead and hit that subscribe button real quick and that bell icon so you're notified whenever i drop new content to the channel so i'd like to thank you guys again for watching until next time